considered to be one of the most exciting players of the modern era, and certainly Northern Territory football's most famous son, AFL legend Michael Long began his football career at St Mary's Juniors, playing his first league game aged 16. He played 52 games for the Saints and was a member of the 1986-87 and 87-88 Premiership teams, as well as club best and fairest in 1988-89. In 1988, he played 22 league games with Sandful Club Woodville West Torrens, finishing third in the McGarry Medal with 17 votes, as well as winning both the Club Champion Award and Best First Year Player Award that same year. Michael represented his beloved Northern Territory in five representative matches from 1988 to 1993. The man with the magical goose step transferred to the Essendon Bombers in 1989 where he had an instant impact in the AFL and was named Rookie of the Year. He is a dual premiership player, starring in the Essendon Grand Final team of 1993, a final in which he won the coveted Norm Smith medal, and he became a premiership player once again in 2000. In 1999, Michael Long became the first Indigenous player to captain an AFL side. In 2002, he was named in Essendon's Team of the Century. And in 2005, he was named in the AFL's Indigenous Team of the Century. Michael retired in 2001, having played 190 games and kicked 143 goals. In 2007, Michael was inducted into the Australian Football Hall of Fame. And in 2010, he was inducted into the AFL Northern Territory Hall of Fame. Michael's courageous stand against racial vilification in football paved the way for radical changes in the game. And today, Michael Long is an AFL ambassador and renowned advocate for Indigenous rights. His famed Long Walk to Canberra led to the founding of the Long Walk Foundation, of which he is patron. A highly decorated footballer, blessed with unique skills and an abundance of determination, Michael's incredible desire to improve the quality of life for young Indigenous Australians continues today as he tirelessly works towards realising his dream, the Michael Long Learning and Leadership Centre.